Okay, I'm going to attempt to do the original uh, setup on this, so we'll see how it goes. First thing you do is turn on the power. Second thing to do is take my source and put it on my at my TV and put it on HDMI 1 because that's where I got it plugged in at. Okay, I know you can't see this and I can't do both, so I'll try to show you a little at a time here. It just says initial setting, welcome, this this unit is ready for initial setup. Please follow on screen instructions, instructions and it says next, or skip, and we'll go say next. That wants to know about your English and everything, so we'll hit English. And an antenna. Okay, now it's going to scan for the channels, and I usually get about 55 channels here. A little less, a little more, mostly a little more than that. We'll see how that goes. And it's still scanning away. So I've got seven channels so far. Now it's jumped up to 12, 19. I've had satellite TV for years and years and years, and finally a sliced increase in uh, payment was just the straw that brought the camels back, and so now I'm on antenna. I've been on antenna for quite a while, but now that I've got this new Magnavox twin tuner uh, DVR, I think I'll be happy with it. So far we've got 43 channels. Forty-seven. Fifty-four. Okay, so it's about 54 channels. So we'll see what's next here. Auto channel preset complete. Digital channels found 54. Press OK. Alright, now it says set weather on your antenna. Okay, well, we can set that. Eastern. You want to activate daylight saving time? Yes. Auto clock setting. Okay, we'll say. Let's just do it manual so I can show you how to do it. Uh, we'll do manual. Okay, and manual is. Hmm, I don't know what they want me to do now. But. Okay. We'll try the third month. And the tenth day, I think it is, of 17. Oh, it must be the eleventh. So it is. It's the eleventh. 17, Saturday. And it's one, two, three, four. And 46. And it's in the PM. All right. No.
I don't think I want that right now. Maybe you do, or maybe I'll do it later. Normal standby. Okay, set the brightness for the front panel. This setting an estimated standby settings is normal standby. We'll set it on automatic. Okay, and there's what kind of picture we got. That looks like a pretty sharp picture. It's got a good tuner in it. At least one. I hope it's got two in it, being that's what it says. Right here you can see, and we'll go up through the channels here a little bit. And I know this is boring, so I'm going to keep with this. I just want to say there's a lot of channels on here that you won't never watch, just like with uh, just like with satellite or cable. There's a lot of channels that you never go watch. However, with this, you're not having to pay no hundred dollars a month not watch them. So you know, it just finally comes a point that you say, why do you keep paying that much money when you can buy this? Like I said in my video, uh, previous video, I think this cost around $350 at Walmart. And in three months, me paying the dish bill, this will be paid for. You know, and then I don't have to worry about it no more. And the only thing I have a hard time with is I'm a news junkie, so I don't get to watch as much news as I did. But that's the breaks. Getting worse a lot of lives anyway. So that's just my opinion. So anyhow, I hope y'all enjoyed this video. I hope you watch more of my videos. Hope you give me a thumbs up. And we'll talk to you again real soon because as soon as I learn how to do more items on this uh, Magnavox DVR player here, which by the way, I've been researching and researching. It seems like this Magnavox is the only one left in the United States that you can record on that doesn't have a monthly charge. This is absolutely free once you hook, you buy it and hook it up. So once you pay for it, that's all. There's no monthly fee or no charges to it. So I hope you enjoy it. I hope more people will start doing this instead of paying that hundred, a hundred fifty, two hundred dollars a month. So. Anyway, that's why we do it around the house, and I hope y'all start doing it around the house more, too. So, hope you enjoyed it. Come back and see us, and have a good day. Goodbye.